In Nederland zijn er jaarlijks 19.000 kinderen die door een chronische langdurige ziekte niet naar school toe kunnen. Dat zijn er ongelooflijk veel. Hierbij bestaat bovendien het gevaar dat een kind in een sociaal isolement raakt. En dat is heel nadelig voor hun ontwikkeling. Ze missen de aansluiting met hun familie, met school, met hun sportclubs, met hun culturele activiteiten. En het kan zelfs leiden tot gedragsproblemen en psychiatrische ziektebeelden. To address this problem, the Norwegian organization No Isolation developed an avatar robot, AV1. AV1 is an avatar for children suffering from long-term illness. So if they have to stay at home or in the hospital, AV1 can work like their eyes, ears and voice at school or at after-school activities. Vodafone in the Netherlands, and in fact most of Europe, have partnered with No Isolation to provide the connectivity between the child and the AV1. And to do this, we have developed a new Internet of Things technology. For the child to really feel that they are there, they need a stable, high-quality video connection. Normal IoT solutions transmit small amounts of data, but we have specifically developed an IoT service that transmits high amounts of data, so that the video streaming is reliable and high quality. To ensure that the AV1 is always well connected, we have equipped it with Wi-Fi and 4G. That means it is well connected inside the classroom, out on the playground and even a school trip. To ensure the privacy of the children, the data is sent through an encrypted tunnel to the end device. Furthermore, the AV1 is only paired with one device, and only the child knows the secret code to unlock this device. There are more than 400 active robots in seven European countries now, but with Vodafone as a partner, our ambition is of course to scale globally. Vodafone actively collaborates in developing the product helps with logistic support and collaborates to bring the product to market. Our company name is No Isolation, so we want to help everyone out of loneliness and social isolation. So it doesn't stop with AB1. We're currently looking into developing technology for seniors as well. This is how technology brings people closer together.